Hi, my name is Atul Rai. I'm the CEO and co-founder of Stacky Technologies. We are an AI startup and uh, we are working in the Homeland Security domain. Uh, currently, we have modified some of our existing technology to deal with COVID-19 situations. In March, we started it with the UP Prism Department. At that point of time, the first idea was to basically identify uh, the PPE compliances uh, because uh, there was a guideline for the government whosoever is going inside the prison must have a mask. Manually uh, monitoring all these uh, things was very difficult. So of course, our video editing which all already was there, we basically modified the technology to identify the mask. So if someone is not wearing the mask, alert comes to the command center of the Jarvis in the Lucknow and then of course there are 70 uh, different locations where these uh, jails are located with the different cameras. So there are 3000 cameras, 70 locations. So in that way, the PPE compliances were uh, being monitored. Let's say uh, this outbreak happens in a very in a very huge manner. In that case, uh, there might be a situation we may have very low uh, medical staff to deal with this. Uh, so in that case, you can use your mobile camera as a streaming device. There will be a command center and that command center can monitor all these activities. For example, if some patient is feeling uneasy, that alert can go. For example, if I'm coughing and sneezing, these kind of activities can be recognized by the AI. So that is where you need not to uh, be there every time in the world. thermal camera to basically calculate the temperature of the whole uh, environment where it is placed and give you the pixel wise temperature of each of the object which is there in the uh, scene. We modified it to identify the temperature of the human body rather than the, all the object in the scene. So for that, you have to identify where the human body is inside the scene. That's first. Second, if let's say if I'm wearing a t-shirt or I'm wearing a coat or I'm wearing a cap, that should not be considered while measuring the temperature. Second, it need to identify those body surfaces which are uh, not having any cover. For example, our hand or the face. In that manner, we have the surface temperature of the skin and that is thresholded against the uh, what is the whatever the medical say that this is the right temperature for anyone for the fever. So let's say you identify this guy Atul is having a high temperature. But at the same time, you also have to know that this is Atul, right? Uh, because you may have to trace him out. And for that, you need a recognition kind of thing. So in that manner, we are creating a hybrid uh, kind of technology, uh, which could be utilized with the existing uh, camera clusters uh, with the thermal camera. Uh, 